Hey, what's up guys? I'm coming back with a 2020 postseason predictions video. It's kind of the part two from last year. So we're going to start in the AL, then we're going to go to the NL, and then end up with World Series in the middle there. So, in the first game, we have Tampa Bay. Tampa Bay versus the Blue Jays. This year, the Blue Jays did play very well. The Hunjin Ryu, Ryu signing worked out very well. But you can't beat the Braves. They're going to move on. And you got Cleveland versus the Yankees here. Cleveland has been playing really good baseball. And Gary Sanchez has not been doing well for the Yankees recently. But I do think the Yankees are going to find a way to pull it out. Now we go on to the Twins versus the Astros. The This game is going to be very good. And I, as all of you know, I hate the Astros. So I'm going to pick the Twins. And Twins, I think, are the good choice there. Now A's versus the Sox. The Sox have been on fire in the year this year. They, they played really good baseball, and so did the A's. But I think it's going to be... A good upset here. Sox are going to win. Here we go over into the NL. You have Los Angeles versus Milwaukee. And, I mean, I don't know how you guys pick Milwaukee here. Their bullpen is pretty good. But Dodgers have to win. Next, we got St. Louis versus, St. Louis versus San Diego. And this year... San Diego has been playing really well. Slam Diego, I should say. So San Diego is going to win. Now we go on to the Cubs versus the Marlins. Hard, hard to believe that last year the Marlins were one of the worst teams in the league. Now they're in the postseason. But the Cubs, get, I really like the Cubs in this postseason. So they're going to win. Then we got the 50-50 one. That, I mean, both teams, Reds are the, one of the best pitching staffs in the league, and the, but the Braves have the one of the best batting lineups in the year, league with Ronald Acuna's 495-foot blast recently. But I do think that the Reds' offense is going to pull it out. Boom. These, this is the ALDS. We got Tampa Bay versus the Yankees. Twins versus White Sox. Dodgers versus San Diego. And the Cubs versus the Reds. Up here, we have the Reds versus the Yankees. No, not the Reds. The Rays versus the Yankees. But, once again, the Yankees, without Gary Sanchez performing well, they're not going to be the team that they can be. So, Tampa Bay is going to move on. Down here, we have the Twins versus the White Sox. As much as I do love the White Sox this year, it's going to be hard to pick them. So, I got to go with the Twins. Over here, we have the Dodgers versus San Diego. So, the San Diego Padres, I'm going up. This is, I feel like this is the right decision. Though, though I hate to do it, Dodgers are going to have to win because this the Dodgers have more experience overall. But the Reds versus the Cubs, I do like the Cubs, but I still think the Reds pitching staff is going to be one of the best in the league. Moving on. Here is the championship series in both leagues. You have Tampa Bay versus the Twins and L.A. versus the Reds. Over here, I do like both teams a lot, and they're both really good. But overall, I think the Twins are going to pull it out. They've been upset last couple of years, and they've had, and I feel like they have enough experience to beat the Rays. Although the Braves did play really well against the Astros last year, I do think at Tampa that the Twins are going to win. But here now we have the Dodgers versus the Reds. 
and it I don't know how you don't go Dodgers here but the Reds they have a really good pitching staff but that's really that's what that's one of their only strong suits the Dodgers have that good pitching staff and a good lineup and now here's the World Series you have ten, the Twins versus the Reds the Twins versus the Dodgers this is going to be one of the harder games to predict, but I feel like the Dodgers are fighting for vengeance this year because of 2017. So I'm going to have to pick the Dodgers as World Series champions in 2020. This year, World Series MVP will have to be Corey Seager. Thank you guys for watching. Peace.